striking a chord, unraveling the essence of a popular phrase. Hello, and welcome to our language learning channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating English phrase, to strike a chord. Whether you're a beginner or advanced learner, understanding such phrases can add richness to your English communication. Let's explore what this phrase means, its origins, and how you can use it effectively in your conversations. To strike a chord is a metaphorical expression used in English. It means to create an emotional response or to resonate with someone. When something strikes a chord, it touches you emotionally or feels relatable. It's like playing a musical chord that produces a harmonious sound, here symbolizing an emotional or intellectual harmony or agreement with someone's feelings or thoughts. The phrase originated from the world of music. In the past, when musicians struck chords that were pleasing and resonated with the audience, it was said to strike a chord. Over time, this term transcended music and began to be used in everyday language to describe situations, speeches, stories, or events that elicit a strong emotional or sympathetic response. Let's look at some examples. 1. Personal stories. Her story about overcoming adversity struck a chord with many listeners. 2. Public speeches. The politician's speech about equality struck a chord with the young voters. 3. Movies or books. The theme of friendship in the novel really struck a chord with me. These examples show how diverse the use of this phrase can be, applicable in personal, social, and artistic contexts. Use the phrase to express empathy or connection. It's suitable in both formal and informal settings. Be mindful of the context. Ensure the subject has the potential to evoke a shared feeling or thought. And that's a wrap on, to strike a chord. We hope this explanation resonates with you and adds a new dimension to your English vocabulary. Remember, language is not just about words. It's about the emotions and connections they forge. Happy learning, and we look forward to seeing you in our next video.